Hi everyone, I have known rational numbers. The question is, give four rational number equal to minus 2 by 7. So what we mean by equivalent? Equivalent is nothing but it is equal to that number. So how to find that? Here the given number is minus 2 by 7. We have to find out a number which is equivalent to minus 2 by 7. So this can be done by either multiplying or by dividing the given number by any number you can do it. For example, let me multiply here. So here is a solution. So you can multiply with any number. Like you can take a smaller number, bigger number completely upon you. I'm going to take a number which is easy to multiply. So let me take here 2. If I multiply with 1, I'm going to get the same number. So I don't want that. I'm going to start with 2. So minus 2 by 7 equivalent rational number will be. So first I'm going to multiply with 2 which means I have to multiply the denominator and the numerator with 2. So multiply 2 in the numerator and denominator don't change the number it has to be same. So this will become minus 4 by 14. Yes the next one you I'm gonna go with 3 now minus 2 by 7 is equal to I'm gonna put equal to sign here because they're equivalent. So the here I'm gonna multiply with 3. So I'm going to multiply 3 in the numerator and denominator. So this will be equal to minus 6 by 21. Like that you can take any number. Let me take here 5 now. Minus 2 by 7 is equivalent to minus 2 by 7. I'm going to multiply with 5 in the numerator and denominator. This is equal to minus 10 by 35. Let me take here 10, the next number. So minus 2 by 7 equivalent to minus 2 by 7. I'm going to multiply here with 10 in the numerator and denominator. This is equal to minus 20 by 70. So you can see that minus 4 by 14, minus 6 by 21, minus 10 by 35, minus 20 by 70, all these are equivalent rational number of minus 2 by 7. Like that we can multiply with any number. You can take 100, you can take 1000, you can take 99. Just make sure that multiplication is easy so that you don't have to put a lot of effort there. Now this is one way of doing it. Like you multiply. Okay. We can do with the division also. But for the given number here, we have minus 2 by 7. Division means we have to take a highest common factor of 2 and 7 or the common factors we can say. Common factors means where we can able to cancel 2 and 7. You can see 2 and 7 we cannot cancel because both are like prime numbers, right? They doesn't go in any table. We cannot cancel them. Suppose I have a number like 6 by 8. 6 by 8 I can divide with 2 because 6 and 8 both goes in 2 table. So here I couldn't divide with 2. Okay. So this will be equal to 3 by 4. So 3 by 4 will be the equivalent rational number of 6 by 8. Like that you can go with division also but make sure that you have a common factor there. And then you can divide. Common factor means both the number in the numerator, denominator should go, should go in a certain table. Then we can cancel it. So here these are the four rational number equivalent to minus 2 by 7. Your answer may be different than my answer. It's depend upon with which number you're multiplying. So there are like infinitely rational numbers. It, it depends uh, depending upon the number you're multiplying. I hope this is clear. In case you have any further question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.